my story. Where can I begin? My story, I feel like, you know, a lot of people come on here, they say the same old stuff. Uh, I'm a street dude, I'm this dude, I'm that dude. I'm a man, and I'm a man who gonna step up to the plate and who gonna handle their responsibilities like a man. I don't fold, I won't tuck my tail, I won't run from no problems. I'm gonna make sure I own up. I'm gonna make sure I make sure I take care of my family, my child, and anybody who around me. I'm what you call a real stand up dude. You know? I ain't trying to be no gangster. I ain't trying to portray somebody I'm not. I am who I am. My rap name is Jimbo World. But to my family, I'm James. That's my government name. And I, I am what I, I am, I am, I am what I am. I'm not trying to be smarter who I'm not. All I can be is me. And what you see is what you're going to get. No faking, no flogging, no cap, no none of that. Where were you born? I was born in Hopewell, Virginia, but I was raised in St. Petersburg, Florida. Still reside in St. Pete today? Yeah. And what age was it when that move happened? On um, St. Pete? Yeah. I was a baby. I don't even remember when I had to move to St. Pete. Yeah, I was still a baby. Do you know what the reasoning was of the move? Um, I don't know, honestly. I just, I know that's why I was, I was raised at St. Pete. That's all I know. And, um... I want to say, honestly, probably because my daddy went fed. You know what I'm saying? My daddy was doing his thing out there in Virginia. Daddy went fed. You know what I'm saying? My mom did a thing, too, in Virginia. So I'm guessing, shit, they wanted a new life for us, so she moved us down to St. Petersburg, Florida. Parents were both in the streets. <sighs> oh, yeah. They were doing their thing. Yeah, they were doing their thing. Is it a certain part of Tampa, um, not Tampa, I'm sorry, a certain part of St. Pete you represent? Not really. I do, you know what I'm saying? But if I had to say I'm Charles Park, 34th, you know what I'm saying? But I'm neutral, so I'm on my face good anywhere, from the 50s, from the projects, from, the, from Belta, from back home, back to 34th. My face good anyway. I got love in my city. Now, your father um, did federal prison time. Yeah. Uh, do you know how long of a bid he did? I think he did like nine years, seven years, something like that, seven, nine years, something like that. And uh, that happened when uh, you were really little. Yeah, I was a, I was a baby. I was still in my mama's belly when he um when he went fed. I think he went fed like ninety two, ninety three, something like that. And then I I was born ninety four. I put that in one of my songs actually. And do you know what he got locked up for? Yeah, um, dope, bricks. And as you're growing up, he's doing seven to nine. So when he gets out, what age? Do you think you probably were? Well, I was if like, you can remember, or what grade, maybe, perhaps. I I want to say I was like, when I nigga got out, I think I was like, I had to be like seven, nine, one one of them ages, something like that. I don't know my daddy fuck nigga though. I don't fuck with that nigga. He's straight. He did his thing. You know what I'm saying? He was he was doing his thing in the streets. What are you filming? But I don't respect that nigga to this day. Shit, if you see this interview, shit, that's how I feel. You know what I'm saying? Because you know, I guess the nigga felt some type of way when he went out the road. Shit, my daddy troll, man. Real nigga shit. We here to keep this shit real. My daddy troll, man. Tch. Nigga with all that snitching and all that crazy shit. I ain't f fuck that nigga. What he did don't even matter. That nigga troll. 
does he try to enter your life at some point? Yeah. He 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 went he went he went distance. Like like he got out. He came to live at my grandma house. I was like I like I said I was like seven or nine. He stayed over at my grandma's house, you know what I'm saying? And I think I think he stayed up for like probably six months to a year, if I can remember correctly. And then he just went, he went missing. I'm 25, I'm 25 years old now. I I just heard from my daddy probably like three, four years ago. He reached out. I think it was like around some time around Christmas time, like three, four years ago. I tried like to get that relationship with him. I'm a grown ass man now. What what can you tell me, bro? Yeah, what 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 really can what, what can you tell me? Ain't nothing you can tell me. All these years done went by. I don't know that. I just know my mama. You know what I'm saying? But whatever. <laughs>